I tend to, I go to Bluey Live. Is that a thing? <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> Bluey Live. You know what? I did see this YouTube video. Uh, I think it was maybe it was Saber Spark. He was reviewing like weird, like quote kids quote YouTube channels. Yeah. And like. One was it was kind of like the Elsa like and Spider Man kids YouTube channels where yeah. they like put a bunch of weird stuff in. Yeah, like the Elsa and Spider Man stuff, but they they, yeah, they, like, yeah. they moved on to people with weird bluey makeup. Oh no! <laughs> it's like got like dumpster quality who's from the oh, Grinch movie kind of makeup to like make the snout. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, uncomfortable. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. Stop it. Oh boy! I, I mean, I, I have managed to catch a few episodes of Bluey. Yeah. Yeah, because uh, one of Amanda's friends has a child. So sometimes it's apparently very good. I mean, I couldn't tell you. I wasn't really paying much attention. Bluey. The general watched... joke is that uh, parents will continue to watch it after their kids have already left the room. Hmm. Bluey is good. That's why. I didn't remember anything about it. I did remember a bit of Daniel Tiger. I thought that was lousy, but it's also for very small children, so I'm not really yes. sure if that's fair. I was like, man, the storytelling, this is just atrocious. This is a bad show. All right, Dave. Show us what you're subjecting us to for the rest of the stream. All right, so I'm mad. We live in a society, and I'm mm -hmm. tired of these Snake Eyes people mm -hmm. and their damn combos mm -hmm. sitting around for 20 minutes. I'm sick and tired of it, Ryan. I'm mad. So, so I'm... what you what you're doing is you're going to take that frustration and that anger and learn the combos, right, so that you can combat them or even join them. No, no, Not even close. I'm instead playing this. Which is just uh, if you if, if I can't play, then nobody can. Full Joker mode right here. This is... I did lose to Final Countdown earlier today. Uh... <laughs> I'm not happy about it. It was Cook Stall. I almost had him a couple times, but I lost to, to Final Countdown Cook Stall. So, so yeah, that's where we're at. Right hey man. Now. All it takes is one bad day. <laughs> All it takes is one bad day. I love the premise of that. <laughs> just go full Joker because I'm like, no. We live in. Did a, you see the thumbnail? We thumbnail live in a, yet, Dave? Not yet. We live in a format. What am I? What am I? It's gonna be this. This ridiculous. Misjudge. Blue Eyes Mausoleum is a terrible field. Okay. I guess we'll just go like full nonsense. Full nonsense? My main cards are Fossil Dina, Necro Valley. <laughs> And this weird fucking spell. <laughs> decisive uh, two? decisive are battle you of Golgonda. Battle of Golgonda. <laughs> the, isn't the Golgonda, Golgonda the poop thing from Dogma? I suggested that we play Stun Two. With with Cyber Valley. Yeah. That's at least kind of a based card to use in like. Yeah, Stun has combos now. But, but of, Dave's doing this to avoid combos. Right? I don't want to do anything. <clears throat> he wants to especially because he's beating the people in Rookie. <laughs> Which, oh, but it's so this is going to go one of two ways, Dave. You're either going to just get a bunch of scoops because you're in Rookie, or you're going to find the most weird stuff that your deck doesn't counter as well as you true. <laughs> Fossil Dino, more like Fossil Fight against some wins. <laughs> <laughs> 
Now we're a hard go first deck, so if we go uh -huh. second, we're kind of shit out of luck here. I think we yes. just immediately scoop. Yep. I don't have Jaugen. That's why we aren't running it. I wasn't about to craft anything for this. I, I spent like maybe 60 ultras and like 60 super gems and that was all I needed to make this. I had most of this stupid deck. Of course you did. What does this even do? This card becomes Great Sea of Golden Wind or it protects whatever. protects your stun cards from getting destroyed by battle. That's all it does. I can dump a, a fusion that states Fallen of Albaz. Instead of the battle first time per turn, if something would be destroyed, you can instead send a fusion that lists Fallen of Albaz as material. Understand. Do you have any of those in your extra deck? Yeah. I've got... Uh, should all Ridbrum the Stinking and Albion Ridbrum. the Sanctifart. You need more than that. Those are the two <laughs> I had. <laughs> Those are the two I had. Uh, there are NR ones, like Sprint. Oh, yeah, nice. You could probably make a bunch. That... Okay, well, we'll do that after this this game. I, I probably don't need a Gave Dragon in here. No. I, I put in some random garbage, honestly. Random bullshit, Go! I'm not gonna ash my own pot of prosperity. All right, let's see. We, we got we got Necro Valley. That's a good start. And I saw all three copies of No Material. That's pretty stupid. Right, maybe you go with that draw card and hope your opponent. Uh, it's a fucking idiot. I don't know. Can't beat you. <laughs> all three copies of No Material. Oh, dear. What the hell was that? I'm sharing Morganite is probably like one of my favorite uh, recent cards. You should just not activate that, by the way. Just don't probably give them not. anything. Probably not, but. Maybe I should take out all the hand traps, because I don't want to go second. If I go second, I scoop, right? Just you like, can't use hand traps. Like, fuck it. That is also true. You cannot use hand traps. I would love, while you have the time, to read Time Tearing Morganite. Ah. <laughs> it is the second line of text. Okay. It is the second line of text. These ash blossoms in your hand are vanillas. They are normal summon Ice. attached power of the guardians and you are against dark magician who does not give a fuck about your entire game plan. Okay. Because we activated Morganite. <laughs> you can't shame do if, anything if about you, it. Uh, you should ash that. Oh wait. You should ash that. You should ask that right now. Fine, we're gonna surrender, because I'm not about to lose the boys. Or to, to Dark Magician. <laughs> Hold on, I have a stun list. Let me see what let me see what I'm packing. Because I played stun in the duelist cup, because those people aren't real. Okay, so I'm gonna take out all these no materials. That was the uh yeah. That was the list that I sent on to on Master Duel. Alright, you wanna keep the shifter because shifter is broken. I want to get rid of Commandant. Really? Yeah, Command... Commandant sucks. Damn it, he surges Necro Valley. Uh-huh, as a effect that you activate in the hand. I could just play three copies of Necro Valley. Yeah, cool. I you have, have three copies of it. I do, for you some fucking... reason. <laughs> uh, for some reason. Put in, put in the three Clockwork Knight. What's Clockwork Knight? Clockwork Knight is a uh, oh that spell. weird what why did why does everyone play this in stun what's the point okay so uh, I want you to read the second line of text machines monsters you control gain 500 attack and defense also machine monsters your opponent controls lose 500 attack and... oh is it that is it the yeah it's less about it turns Fossil Dyna into what is effectively a 2200 attack point monster. Gotcha. Okay, see, I, every time I read this, I just was like, I'm a turning my guy, my opponent's guys into machines. Why do I care? It's yeah. No, it's a uh, thousand attack swing. Put evenly right. matched in here. In case we get forced to go... In case we go second. Okay. And also, also in stun... Just getting your board wiped and then evenly matching them after battle phase is killer. Use Dark Sanctuary. Uh, what, uh, what, uh, barriers that would be the time. Do you have? 
None of them. You don't <clears> have <throat> any of the barrier statues? I don't think so. How is that possible? I have the dark one. That's what? the worst it's one. Probably the probably want to run the water one. The one that you want to run right now is the earth one. Earth or water? It's the earth one right now. There's no earth decks. Fenrir! Uh, put Regeki in this. I don't know why you're not on Regeki. Yeah. Cool. There you go. There we go. Uh, now in your extra deck. Oh, shit. Uh, <laughs> which are, since you're playing <clears throat> the the Golgonda stuff, I want you to uh, check, put a filter for fusion, and you're going to look for the Fallen of Albaz fusions that are cheap. Oh, like Sprint the Iron Dash Dragon. And yeah. Brigand the Glory Dragon. And uh, you see all those Link monsters you got there? I'll take them out. I'm going to keep uh, those four. Because it might... It, it, I, yeah, that's fine. I might want to have those in to turn off the... Yeah. Yeah, put that shit in there. <laughs> if that shit says Fallen of Albaz, get that shit in there. Okay. Those are the, all the cheap uh... ones. Okay, it's the so... weirdest villainous deck I've ever seen. Yeah, this is the Joker one. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're gonna put uh, two more cards in extra deck. This uh, is your brain you on any... Nick Rakeki. Do you have any royals? Just like royal rare cards. Yeah. Do you have any royal extra deck cards? Uh. Royal finish. Yeah, we got. A couple. Hell yeah. Put that Melfi in there. Put that uh, Fergit in there. Because fuck it. I mean, she's part of the Albaz lore. True. This is a lore deck now. I do have the, the this Just Desserts. <laughs> How did That's you... so funny. That's... <laughs> what a stupid card. I'm sorry, but Just Desserts... <laughs> Is so funny as a, as a royal. <laughs> Just Zeds. Joker would play trap decks. Yeah, and then uh, send it. There's no laws against the trap decks, Batman. <laughs> There's no laws against the trap decks, Batman. Don't do it, Joker. <laughs> Why would we play Natis? We can't send Natis. Please. You have to be playing deck. Nadir. <clears throat> You'd have to be playing Dogmatica Punishment, which he is not. Which I don't have any of those cards. Which is They're rare. Well, the punishments are rare. Queuing into Rookie with this? Yeah. I guess Nadir's Servant would be the only ultra rare. <clears throat> the rest of them are pretty cheap. Come on, sideways. We are queuing into Rookie with this. Yep. Dave woke up and chose violence. Did I pick him up first? Yeah. What are you doing? Draw phase. Draw phase Maxi. Please Draw do. Draw phase wanted. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I feel like rookie you're going to get like starter deck or people who just open up a new account to get the gems to play Snake Eyes. I'll be able to <laughs> have uh, nice things uh, soon, eventually, maybe. <laughs> a royal rare Parasect Parasite, really? I have like three Royal Rare Fluanderies cards. Yeah, I have a couple of Royal Rare Fluanderies. I have. Yeah, Eaglin, I have one too. What? What the fuck? <laughs> I have Eaglin, Snowl, and uh, I think I have the Big Penguin. Unexplored Winds. Okay, so he didn't do anything for whatever reason. So we're gonna summon Fossil Dino and Moon Mirror Shield. Where's Marion? I finally did it. <laughs> He made fun of me all the time for this combo. I don't think I've ever actually played it. <laughs> That's because of episode one of Mental Yu-Gi-Oh. <laughs> Mental Yu-Gi-Oh. I did it in Mental Yu-Gi-Oh, but that's only because he had said it. I put it in my, like... <laughs> Ryan was like, okay, what are you going to do? Moon Mirror Shield it? And then you're like, Moon Mirror yeah. Shield. Fucking asshole. <laughs> <laughs> 
fossil dino moon mirror shield. <laughs> oh, you you got you spent three K gems and got nineteen URs for Snake Eye. I am on twenty seven thousand gems. I have one Diabell Star. Okay, so this guy normal summoned true oh, tune warrior. Deck. He's gonna try to attack over it because his attack is higher wow. than your monster. Fucking smashing ground. Oh. You got so owned. <laughs> I guess. I guess. Do it again. <laughs> yes. Wow, what an out! I'm about to get hit with fucking sixteen hundred vanilla. God damn it! It's your one weakness. Vanilla. Spot removal. Fucking nonsense in a the starter deck nonsense. <laughs> That's Smashing Ground is not a real card. I mean, it's a, uh, it's okay. See, that's the problem with playing a very heavy anti-meta deck is that they, for some reason, often have a terrible matchup against other jank. Old you. Yeah. And You're it's not rookie, just like so... well, it's like well because it's tuned against a, a specific deck. Of course, it has a bad matchup against everything else. But like, even if it's like this deck, it's which comical. is, which is like. It's not against Snake Eyes, it's against anything that's Special Summon. So in theory, I should have my bases covered. But not. However, <laughs> but nah. Warrior over here. <laughs> Dude, would Warrior beat down? You're losing to starter deck, you say. All right, this guy got this guy got fossil dino moon mirror shielded, and he two, didn't scoop two turns in a row. What's he got? Incoming oh. Regeki. <laughs> yeah, what battle traps are in the in the in the in the side or in the starter deck? None. You say that? I wish that shit came with battle traps. Because I think we're actually woefully weak to those. <clears throat> yeah, uh, I was playing stun in the Duelist Cup and kept getting hit by Mirror Force. And I'm like, oh, <laughs> dude. Nice. To play around Force. Mirror Force? Okay, he set one. He T-set pass. Yeah, I can't even turn that back row off. Okay, we got Newman. We got a... A terrible monster that does nothing. We got a backup. <laughs> Dino, get it. Oh shit, it's crowned by the world chalice. That's one of the best monsters. That shit has 2100 defense. <laughs> Standing by. I mean, like, Mirror Force was okay, and Master Rule 4 is such a funny statement, because uh, in the anime, Revolver, the guy who plays Rockets, for the first half of the anime, his ace card is Mirror Force. Oh, this guy is either a robot, or doesn't hasn't read my card. It's Probably a robot. But yeah, uh... Ro uh, Revolver's ace card is uh, Mirror Force. Yeah, everyone's what he does is mode. he lets the Goki player combo off sitting on one monster and then Mirror Forces him for six. <clears throat> and he did that to Altergeist too. But he also red rebooted an Altergeist player. <laughs> that was very funny. Which is evil. Well, he just he's out here playing real cards. <laughs> yeah. Well, that's what I she didn't gets. Summon for the other her... fossil dino, Dave. Yeah, I didn't want to overcommit. Uh... Overcommit? <laughs> I know it sounds. Really... Overcommit? We're playing goat format level strats here, where you just you, you hold your resources. You don't just go ham sandwich on starter deck. You say. <laughs> 
just in case. It's got other bangers in there, like fish or another fucking one of those. Yeah. I'm getting some deja vu all over again. I've been in this place before. Higher on the streets. Time to go. The amount of advantage you are generating is phenomenal. <laughs> Third damn fossil tide of food fear shield. <laughs> Never done it before in your life. Right, three Dixie. times in one duel. Are you ready for third one? If you live. I mean, he's not going to overlay in anything. He's got five cards in his extra deck. It's got diddly shit in there. And neither of those are a tuner. It's not a tuner. Did you ever get that replay for Fossil Dino Moon Beer Shield Turbo? Is that the, uh... That was the, 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 Christmas the, special? the Christmas special. Christmas Carol. I don't even want So you could leave. infinite impermanence them here, and then you could, like, evenly match them. For... I had the thought. <laughs> Trust me, I opted to not do it. Because <laughs> I would be evening so for one! Cool. Yeah, but it outs the board. <laughs> when else are you going to use this imperm, Dave? <laughs> oh, no. Against this deck, never. Man, this move mirror shield, though, has been putting in work. Eh. One way of putting it. I mean, there's no way he's got three A third smashing, smashing ground. ground. <laughs> There's no <laughs> way, right? With, like, it's just it, not gonna the happen. The deck only comes with two. Okay, we're good. <laughs> <laughs> Who's ready for an encore? That one's got an effect. Who's ready for first. smashing ground? <laughs> Here's where he hits you with hammer shot. <laughs> <laughs> he just got him. He just got every one of them. And he's like, it's like fissure offerings to the doomed. Mm -hmm. Oh God. Tribute to the doomed. <laughs> Take me back to Prague with that shit, Doug. Dave loses a surprise <laughs> magician. <play>. I, uh. <laughs> to add one spell card back to my hand! So oh, I've no. been doing a oh, no. series uh, <laughs> with a couple of my buddies, and we're in, we're in GX right now. And uh, I pulled for next week, and uh, I have constructed Gladiator Beast. <laughs> nice! You should put in Moon Mirror Shield. Don't just see if anyone knows. That, that doesn't come out for ten years, it, Dave. They might. Yeah, not Moon have Mirror Shield is like a new card or newer card. We're slowly but surely beating this bot. No. He's beating himself. <laughs> He's not special summoning. My deck has accomplished well, Yeah, there's a fossil dino on the field, <laughs> Dave. Your deck has accomplished something. <laughs> well, we're going to ignore the fact that he didn't special summon during the turn. It wasn't there. <laughs> there's well, not... yeah, you killed his tuner. Oh, well, <laughs> and he has five cards in his extra deck. I'm assuming none of those are XC plays. He has Toon Warrior. <clears throat> They're synchros. If I remember right, it's a, uh, it's like Proxy Dragon, Traffic Ghost, uh, some dog. I'll wait to see three duels all night. <laughs> oh yeah, I'll buckle up. Get you comfortable. Can't, you can't normal summon Newman either. You, why didn't you search for Morganite, man? Search for Morganite, Dave. I didn't. Prosperity. I forgot that Prosperity doesn't zero out your battle damage. It halves it. 
but who cares? You can still do it, and you can still do it in the main phase of two if you really cared about that extra 600. You know what would do more damage? If you had five monsters on field. With Clockwork Knight. Yeah, I'd say I'd, I'd settle for two at this point. Too bad you did dick. Traffic Ghost as an animation? Yeah, it does. Now, unlike Extravagance, Prosperity does not have a activation condition on when you can do it. Wow, oh, Sorcerer dude. Spell Wall. Can't out this. <clears throat> Out. All right, let's draw another card here. Let's go. I could summon Shifter in attack mode. Why? All right, let's see. Let's see how we can get. Banish all the Link monsters, Dave. Ah, <clears throat> <laughs> oh, Morganite, thank God. All these cards that don't do anything. Right. Now set Newman so you can tribute summon Shifter next turn. Oh, because Shifter's a six. LOL. Yep. <clears throat> I think that Morganite's not a continuous spell card is actually really nice. Mm hmm. It also banishes itself to protect your normal summons. It's uh, It does it with uh, other additional copies of Morganite since it's once per duel. You banish a Morganite and discard a Morganite, and then your normal summons are protected that turn. Neat. Your opponent can't chain to them. It's 100% a stupid sun card. Yeah. It's it's the playground rules. <laughs> it imposes playground rules upon one player. Then he's I I would I want to say with Ledger of Ledger Man. Deep draw. Worst part about this being a bot. He's slow, he's slow playing. <laughs> right? <clears throat> Did they just like program thinking into it? Like, what? God, what is that? It's a mirror force. God, you know what it is. Nope. I mean, you can attack with, uh, with your boy and then shifter. You can tribute set shifter if it goes wrong. It's true. Nothing in this deck gets over tribute set shifter. <laughs> there was no activation. Pause. Tribute set that motherfucking shifter right now. <laughs> Millennium Shield. <laughs> <laughs> you didn't even set the rivalry! Or the judgment. I don't need to set that shit. What if you get dusted? Probably should have set the judgment. That I should have said. It'll be so owned. That would be hilarious. You're gonna get so owned, Dave. I imagine his deck is out of anything to stop this. You'd think so. <clears throat> You're gonna be so old. Oh, I got that thing. Okay. I can only set border. Can that be normal summoned or special summoned if you control monster? Monster. I can. Yeah, but it can be set. Summon. I can flip summon it. It can be flip summoned. It's a shame that. Even though you have two normal summons, you can't flip some in it. Alright, Dave, your monsters are protected by Golgonda. Go wild. 
surely that, you won't get like is that destruction at all or just battle destruction Destroy. he's got something you gonna get like now. lucky punched or something stupid memory of an adversary oh fuck <laughs> he's gonna steal your dyna oh <clears throat> now he can special summon. Oh my god, he's owned you. Uh, guys, I don't think he's seen how many defense points Dimensional Shifter has. If you lose to this, Dave... Oh, I'm gonna be really actually kind of mad. <laughs> It'll be so funny. Memory of an <laughs> it's adversary? It's... Really? Fucking seriously? <laughs> <laughs> and he can get over border there, too. Well, no, because you can protect it, but... So funny. We should have even. I mean, unironically, you would not be in position this position if you had evenly matched him. Uh, no, you. Oh would've. my god. You can't. You cannot Cause, activate judgment. Because he you ran in. Life. He ran both those monsters into your monster. <clears throat> Rivalry him. Wait, does negating Call of the Haunted send the monsters to the I don't know, graveyard? I was just thinking that myself, actually. I know bouncing it doesn't do that, but... Oh, these are both warriors, aren't they? <laughs> it's worth a try, right? I guess. Try activating infinite impermanence, see if you can negate the, uh... I don't know that you want to do that, I think you want do Shifter to... Do that. Do yeah, you want that. Shifter do to die, because... That. Okay, alright. You well, lose. You lose yeah. the game. You you just lost the game, Dave. You you just lost yourself the game. Because now I got a guy in attack mode. Yep. Yes. You could have let, could have let him go. Dave. I'm taking I... your stun card away from you. They did not get rid of him. Nope. <clears throat> You refuse to win! That felt really bad. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. That was... I can't really... believe you let that happen. It was rough. <laughs> it was really rough. And that, that wasn't like your opponent outplayed you. You just... You just played poorly. Yeah. Yeah. Well, at least in Rookie, if you lose, you get a rank up. True, if you lose enough, you'll get to bronze. <laughs> it's just like the ultimate participation trophy. Yeah. 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 It's okay, Dave. You're just having a bad day. Just It's okay. It's okay. Just it, one this bad, is day. bad day. This is <laughs> <laughs> oh, chain, 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 Shotgun chain, 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 the chain, shifter. Shifter and draw. Shifter and draw. Come Shotgun on, the go! shifter. Playing blue eyes. Shotgun the shifter. His name is Blue Eyes 12, Dave! I didn't have shift, I had it on auto. You know, you can hold the mouse, the left mouse button down and it'll go to on. Really? Yep. Yeah. You can hold the right mouse button down and it'll go to off. Yeah. Just anywhere on the screen. Yeah. Does it say that it's doing that? Yes. Yeah, it'll change. Because I don't, that doesn't appear so. Do you have toggle on in your settings? Maybe. Oh, this motherfucker is about to learn how shifter works. Dragon in the spirit of way. Oh, he knows. This is a great opportunity to evenly match. Yep. 
<laughs> what is this hand? All traps. Eek. <clears throat> We're gonna lose to this too. Yep. No, we're not. See, we're fine. We have so much life points to work with. We better draw something pretty fucking good. We will get Fossil Dyna off the top. It'll clear the blue eyes. That's not going to do anything, though. <clears throat> okay. Uh, Necro Valley. Oh. Necro Valley will stop them from doing shenanigans. We just have to be careful with Solemn Judgment. Uh, yeah, I, I, can't, I, I, I honestly can't use it until he attacks me. He's gonna synchro summon. It's gonna be fine. That is true. This is not good. Unless he successor souls his own blue eyes. Yep, his blue eyes can't attack. King of D, we're fine. Protector, we're still okay. Mm, that's game. No, it's not. Oh, blue eyes can't attack. Yeah, he targeted it with his card. <clears throat> as long as blue eyes white dragon is face up on his field. That's a pretty good rip. That's, That's a pretty really good rip. Good. That's, That's a pretty good rip. <laughs> oh my god, come on. Pray in the stun. You just need two cards. As long as they're the right two. Okay. Oh my god. Fossil Dine is huge here. I guess we set it? Set Fossil Dino. Yeah, set Fossil Dino face down, set the Imper. Because that's just going to destroy the blue eyes. <clears throat> yep, it'll get rid of the blue eyes white dragon. And um, neither of them the can get over it. The dragon spirit of white is in his hand, right? That's the card that's in his hand? Uh, no, that was banished face down. Okay. So we don't know what the last card in hand is then. Nobody's gonna try to special summon from the graveyard. I'm gonna stop that. You don't need to. Necro you Valley is on the field. Necro Valley. Oh. <laughs> oh <well. laughs> Forgot what the card did. <laughs> graveyard. No. This is going to be huge. This is going to be huge. Fossil Dino effect. Pop oh, that. No. We, we're stabilizing. He can't special summon anymore, so he's lost access to his deck. He now he's just to, frustrated. He has to tribute summon Blue Eyes White Dragon, but we have two Solemn Judgment. <laughs> <laughs> Come on, Moomir Shield! Damn it. Blockwork Knight would be huge. Would be. I mean, you could. Uh... We just need to continue to set monsters. Yeah. We just need. We just need board presence right now. <laughs> <laughs> Smash into that thing too. <laughs> yep. Let's see what top decks get him out of this. He Does he have any blue eyes in deck? Like, He's are all three. Uh, check his grave. See if he has three blue eyes in there. He has two in his grave. He has two in his grave. 
So what gets him out of here is Successor Soul, uh, Blue Eyes White Dragon. If he gets Successor Soul, Blue Eyes White Dragon, we probably lose. We just gotta keep keep the board presence up. Set that second judgment. Set that third judgment. Just set the third so judgment. So many judgments. Holy cow. True light. Send. That's that's really bad. Yeah, I don't think you you could probably impermanence that. Or judgment. I don't know. Actually, judgment that. I would judgment that. Judgment it, because then I think it should clear his board. Because that gets them to. No, it doesn't. Oh, because it's it not on the field it yet. It didn't. Uh, it's not control. face up. Yeah. <clears throat> it was never flipped face up. It was never on the field to begin with. But it did stop that nonsense. I mean, I guess you could have, like, impermanenced it, and then on his turn, when he tried to activate it face up, you could have judgmented not, it to clear the board. No, that's not Why how not? judgment works. Judgment can't do effects. Oh, gotcha. All right, let's see if he attacks my face downs. Nope. Come on. We need he doesn't trust there. your face downs. We need when Time Tearing Morganite gets us there. Uh, Clockwork Knight gets us there. Another Newman. Third Newman does not get us there. Set the judgment, please. We need to be careful of... We need to be ready to stop the tribute summon. <laughs> or like gosh. the Regeki or... Oh my gosh. Yeah. We need to be able to... We can stop his spell traps. How did you them. draw all... I don't think Newman's very good, Dave. It's his signature card, Ryan. And I don't have statues. Okay, he's an idiot. We can negate that card. We can't even do anything. All right, here's where we start getting some reflective damage. Nice. <laughs> Meet Newman. <laughs> <laughs> the turtle lined up is menacing. Boy, <laughs> <laughs> so hey, bad. Dumbass. Hey, dumbass. <laughs> Third Me one, Newman. go! Just Third do it. one, do it. do it! Damn it! Yeah. <laughs> uh, you just gotta flip Coward. over. Just, just flip it over. Surely no, the third one is a turtle. That would put it in attack mode, Dave, Ryan. You I know. Flip it. I, I would say flip it and attack into with the 300, just to be like... No, don't do that. We need that. We need the tribute fodder for dimensional uh, it's your boy, Newman. And the trap card, or this quick play spell he has set, we have the... We have the Imperm for it. Yeah, he put it in a column like a, like a poop head. Yeah, well, I mean, he had a... Oh, it was a, it was a face-down maiden. What it oh, is. boy. Ah, that's so funny. Set maiden. Set Best maiden play. pass. Hey, did you know that maiden doesn't have an effect on this board? <laughs> It's true. We got decisive battle. Okay. okay. Do not activate that. Do okay. not do that. Okay. I mean, I think you just sit. We just and... we we just wait. We can wait him out. <clears throat> he has to interact with our card. We don't have to interact with him. Uh, I'm not were... stuck in here with you. Do I care about this? Mm, no. It's a no. special summon, right? Yeah, it's if you ritual it, or fusion. It, strength and unity is dark magical circle, but for blue eyes. And it's, again, not going to do anything. It lets him add blue eyes white dragon to the hand. We don't care about because Necro adding, Valley adding says from move from the graveyard. Necro Valley is a very good card. <clears throat> what is at rest stays at rest. No graveyard. We need Morganite. <laughs> we need to see Morganite. You've Damn. seen like the same three cards the entire duel. Yes, I might set this. Uh... I would. I would normal summon that, <laughs> and then just like crash into his dude. We can't. There's certainly a risk there. Yeah. 
mean, it wouldn't be from Mirror Force. Oh. What are you attacking? <laughs> the third Newman. <laughs> this guy's taking so much damage from that. Third Newman. <laughs> it's the third Newman that gets you, buddy. <laughs> that was just curious. <laughs> it's Dinah. <laughs> I was just curious. Now we can use this Dinah to start picking apart his board. And we don't even care if it's Mirror Force. Yeah, That's right, Blue Eyes 12. <laughs> the only outs he had was Successor Soul Draw Blue Eyes I mean, Dragon. at that point, it's like... Staring down a full board of three Newmans and two Fossil Dyna is not... Yeah, he really couldn't special something. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and you really bricked. <laughs> All right, let's go. We all knew this was going to be a slog. We're not here for the duels. Yeah, I'm never going to get that, that gold pass. Not at this rate. I need, like, a really quick deck that just, like... Hey, you know what those are called, Dave? What? Meta. Meta. Uh, activate Snash 1. I'll scoop. I don't have the, I don't have the gas to play through a Snake Eye board, brother. Basically. You have it. I, I won like four games in a row just activating Ash. Okay, so we got uh there can only be one. There can be only one. Yeah, the bad part about stun right now is so many people are like fighting it. Like give up. Right? I think at this point, you know how some people just keep scammers on the phone forever? Yeah. They're just biting the bullet and taking it for taking a loss. It's another bot. God damn it. I don't <clears throat> know if you can beat this guy. <laughs> also, the other Summons thing with... Blade Night Pass. The other aspect of trolling the meta is actually playing the meta, which requires doing well enough to see the meta. It's true. Yeah, we gotta get there. Out yeah, with this deck. Not with this deck. You you have a habit of picking decks that are not fast. Yes. Like when was like when was the last props. time when was the last time you didn't win in time, Dave? Good question. Like of the of the people here. Not a fan think, of this board right now. I think I play the fastest decks because I play a bunch of OTK shit. Ryan's the guy in the middle, and you're the guy that is in time, you're the reason the rules got changed. <laughs> it's it's they're wearing fault. a football helmet the entire game. All of most of my decks can at least OTK, but it's not like the primary win con. Yeah, I can't believe it's the same stupid deck. Yeah, it's a bot, Dave. You're gonna lose to it. No, it's okay. We got, we, we got, so we got Tigbo. Tigaboo, save us. Tigaboo, save us. Tigaboo, save us. Tigaboo, save us. Help you know, us, Tigaboo, your only hope. Whoa, hold on. Actually, it's a real person. Oh? The bot can't make a decision if you Tigaboo them. It's not designed to react to that prompt. Maybe maybe the new AI is uh, no taking over. <clears throat> Chat GTP plays Yu-Gi-Oh. This mm -hmm. is a real person, and you're gonna get owned by this not a top oh, deck. We got him. <laughs> <laughs> we got him. Uh, draws a monster that <laughs> draws a monster, monster and cool. another power of the guardians. Just, just put both of them on Dinah and end this. Mm -hmm. This is this is your win con. This is your fast win con. Is power the guardians? Yeah, it's not Moon Mirror Shield and Fossil Dinah. It's power the guardians and Fossil Dinah. Card is unoutable. Gonna be what twenty two hundred? Yeah. <clears throat> We 
We did it, boys. We're gonna win this one. This is gonna be. Oh, you shut. You shut down his call. Call of the haunted. He's gonna 100% uh, smashing ground me though. Yep. Uh -huh. which oh, which is fine. Think read power which of the fine. Guardians. Which is fine. I actually remembered what power of the guardians does. <laughs> Begging you to read your cards <laughs> on my hands and knees, crying. <laughs> smashing ground. <laughs> I uh. I gleamed that one. That was a. Uh huh. Well, both. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah. Sure. Oh, no. That just ate through all of my gems. I hate you. I mean, he can't attack. He can't attack you without you getting up to 2200, right? That might have been a real person because it's scooped. Right? <clears throat> no, it is a real. It was a real person. That's what I'm saying. Third ground. <laughs> no, it's him playing. It's somebody playing the starter deck. Yeah, the starter deck only comes with two. Great uh, coin look today. This guy's playing Master the Duel is rough. hitting you. Yeah, he was playing too quickly to be a bot. That's what I commented on the bot earlier, was that he was slow playing. Shifter! Yeah. Oh. Also, if you present the bot with, like, a binary choice that requires input... You should probably uh, shifter, Dave. It breaks. Really? Yeah. Before you have any cards in grave, because you can't do it later. And shifter lasts until your end of your opponent's next turn. So I would recommend chaining Shifter here. <clears throat> so why not? Just <laughs> show him a bunch of fucking nonsense. <laughs> Clockwork Knight goes so hard here. Uh, uh, but like, yeah, I think I think we want. Do I want judgment? Or Dinah. I I think I think what you do is you you clockwork knight, you normal summon uh Newman, you activate decisive, and they just uh scoop. Mm hmm Because these nice that works. You can't protect it because you can't send, but they don't know that. Still a thousand attack swing. See what he does. Oh, because I've shiftered, so I can't use the <coughs> yeah. Golgotha thing. Yep. Golgotha, yeah. <laughs> Golgotha is the name of the shit demon from the dog one. Uh oh, he's on some nonsense too. Uh oh. His first act was to set a card way over in the pendulum Fuck. zone. <laughs> Fuck. That's how you know. He's not doing anything else, though, so that's a good sign. Oh, you know what I just realized? What? Newman stops Kashtira. Yeah. It's actually good. Yeah. Because Kashtira Snake Eye is the most popular variant on ladder right now. Yeah. It's just got to survive this turn. Then it can go in defense mode, and it's, like, basically unkillable. <laughs> 2300 defense. Yeah, they need something with 2,900 attack they can normal summon to out it. Fuck. What the fuck is that? And now! Is it allowing me to activate this? No. Uh, I don't... It's does it... not cost? It sends for effect? Then yeah. <clears throat> oh. Fuck off. Broke. Oh, die. Oh <laughs> my god. Oh, oh, oh my. <laughs> oh my god. That's uh -oh. gross. Uh -oh. I'm gonna say slur. <laughs> does does that does that stack? 
Yes, Clockwork Knight stack. Since Clockwork Knight stack. Yes, Clockwork Knight stack. <laughs> Is your monster now bigger than his? Yeah. Okay. Ooh. I'm sorry. He's playing. He's playing Destiny Board. Yep. All right. Well, we got to start. We got to win. You got to win quick, Dave. Oh, oh no, it's your one no. weakness. It's done. <laughs> Medium turtle. <laughs> uh, fun no fact, longer tiny turtle. There is no monster he can summon that now outs tiny turtle. He would have to specifically... Something He's playing a normal 21. summonable monster with 2,000 attack. <laughs> He's like, Megalo Smash your X, go! <laughs> and then it trades. <laughs> However, we have Golgonda. When two stun players meet. He can't even do any like weird level shenanigans either because Newman's level one. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Here comes Gene Warped Warwolf. I might give them the game if he saw right? you. Wow. Witch of the Black Forest. Going in for the search. Yeah. Sure. This motherfucker has never read your cards. Trying to place a spirit message. <laughs> Alright. N. Why did you do the middle one? You start with L, dumbass. No, you start with the M. It gets the chat going. <laughs> <laughs> I, he just called you a slur. <laughs> uh, that's why they don't they don't have a chat feature in this, but that's about as close as it gets. He's sending you a message. You got GG easy and then spirit <laughs> yeah, message and <laughs> Let's oh get an Xbox God. player. It's just game game recognizes game, right? He's sending you a nice. Yeah, it's yeah. I really don't want to smash into this because it's like gonna get something he needs, but uh huh. <clears throat> Nickels negate, right? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not like this. What's witch searching? I have no Search idea. Your last pathetic monster, Yugi boy. Uh, Dark Spirit of Banishment. Who cares? And that's crazy. What do? So like, so like, Dark Spirit of Banishment and Dark Spirit of uh, Punishment have like this cool loop they do, where they add each other back from the graveyard, right? <laughs> Wait a minute. Because <laughs> <laughs> shit. Hold. Hey, up. hey, what's Necro Valley's text say? Hold up. And before this guy isn't trying to win with spirit messages, he just has Ann in his deck. <laughs> <laughs> you can check it later. <laughs> that clockwork would work in um, Chain Beat. I think it works in a lot of things. <clears throat> was he trying to special summon the message? Why was that negated? Because I was he couldn't he can't move any cards from his graveyard. Now he's trying to move something. <clears throat> now we go on the offensive. Right. Fucking power of the guardians. Ah, <laughs> uh, remember those. Dual Link streams, Dave. Yeah, I've never seen Tetsuno Arat Newman as such an attack threat before. This deck is certainly offensive. No <laughs> wonder Dave got slurred.
My turtle is bigger than anything you possibly have. He can't even do the thing where he special summons the... Nope! ...the control swapper, because he can't get it in rotation, because it requires uh, moving it from the graveyard. Look at the defense on that bad boy. <laughs> There's not a single card in his deck that can stand up to this card. Isn't Clockwork Knight so cool? Yeah, it's neat. This is an Earth Machine card, by the way. <laughs> is there any of the random people's villain origin story? I mean, that was the impetus of the deck. Alright, now he's just setting shit, so now we need another monster. Yeah. Shout out to my to my buddies in the uh, uh, Lufan Karma testing circle for stun 2, by the way. I know a lot of it's gaining a lot of traction lately with MBT and everyone doing it, but just wanna just wanna make sure that everybody here knows that it was Redux, Dimax, Chloe, and me, and Threams that helped put it together mostly. And I, yeah, I was there. <laughs> uh, it was not Jaxel. It was not Saz. They were not there. Uh, I think he's trying to send you a message. Uh, yeah. Ah, uh, he is sending you a message. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> he is. He's like a knight. Sangan. He's a knight who says me. And this man drops a G. We got <laughs> spirit message G. What? <laughs> That's not a card! Where'd you get that? <laughs> this is where he activates Clockwork Knight. I mean, I think his deck is faster than yours. Yeah, I'm a little worried. <clears throat> I think you need to run Final you Countdown. Draw a monster. Yeah, but you, does, well, don't you have to play them in the, the FINAL order in order well, for... Well, so I was about to say... So the good news is that if he activates Destiny Board, he can't win anymore. Yeah, Unless like... he's playing multiple copies of the Spirit Messages. Because Destiny Board has to place them in order. It's not in order on the board, it's it sequential. or like the, they don't, It doesn't matter where they are yeah. as long as they were placed in the order and <clears throat> spells out the word. No, they all have to be on the board. However, Destiny Board specifically has to place them in order. No, that's what I mean. I don't I meant they don't have to be physically on the board to spell a word. Yes, but they can just be on the board. Uh the problem the problem is that he needs the, the field card spell? destiny board has to play them in order. Like it, it will play it will play F and then it will attempt to place I and unless he has a second copy of I it will attempt to place I every turn. Because Destiny Board has to place them in order. Well, we'll get there eventually. <clears throat> Maybe he's spelling nice. Nice cock. <laughs> <laughs> Which of the Black Forest... Sangan. He's just he's just blowing through his deck at this point. But yeah, the uh the trap card that he played, Tour of Doom, is supposed to bypass that and speed it up by placing them in reverse order. Because it can play any of the letters. Yeah, personal win condition, you just get to spell anal. <laughs> you need to recycle Tour of Doom to do that. <laughs> like, like, oh, that's like, like, it's not that I wouldn't win or that it's childish and dumb. It's that, well, no, it's kind of a, that's not really a, a, a viable play, really, honestly. It's kind of hard to recycle continuous traps. Hey, we can Raigeki that face down. Yep, that, that feels really stupid, but we kind of have That's to. That's what you're supposed to do in this deck. 
Rugeki <laughs> Sangan. Search Witch of the Black Forest, I guess. I mean, you're gonna do like 3k to him. I guess he's out of targets. This is where. Oh! <laughs> he's out of targets? That's a big turtle. <laughs> I love that he can play him out of order. It's just Tora Doom that does that. Sentence of Doom? We need another monster. Yeah. <clears throat> Very cool card. Come on, Fossil Dino. We just need a monster. Nice, Fossil Dino. Uh, that is a 22 attack, 100 attack point monster. Boom. All right. He's got God, it. it feels wrong to see a big number on Fossil Dino. Right. <laughs> it's Destiny Board. I, I'm so sorry, Nagal. Um, please Finn. read Destiny Board. <laughs> Finn! <laughs> You have to read Destiny Board, my brother. <laughs> you have to place them in reverse the man called order. called his own game. The, old, is the old, his own end of game. So that when what Destiny Board places the eye, they're all on board. So what what you're supposed to do is, uh, you flip Destiny Board. Destiny Board will place I. You use uh, Doom to place L. Then on the next turn, you use uh, Destiny Board to place N at the same time that Tour is playing A. So it does it in two turns. Oh, so you mm -hmm. made it in the middle? Yeah. You are intended to play it in reverse order because Destiny Board was made in 2005 uh, by someone who hates fun <laughs> uh, and requires it to be dramatic and place them in order. And if you have eye on field or in rotation somehow and you do not have a second copy your destiny board will attempt to place it every single turn can we talk about this oh he made me go first and my opening is <laughs> inspector border <laughs> inspector border <clears throat> necro valley power of the guardians set evenly matched it probably should set evenly matched really yeah. Because you can't activate it from your hand. I can't? Nope. Why? You have a card. You have to control no cards. Ah. I just kind of assumed that if, if <clears throat> I was in an opportunity to use it, I was he had cleared my board. He might not clear the field spell, though. He might not clear the field yeah. spell. <laughs> this is a rough... He's like, now you go first. I got an OTK strat. Oh. <laughs> Shit. Oh. I should have gone first. <laughs> Seriously, <laughs> Tim, how bad are you at this game? <laughs> Guys, he's looking at DFL star in hand and wondering why why card no activate. His name's Ninja Tears, so he's probably crying on the inside right now. I read it as Ninja Taters, <laughs> actually. Whoa, 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 Dark Snake Syndrome and, and Graveskeeper's Servant? Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. He's uh -oh. also playing something really fucking dumb. Uh-oh. Yeah. <laughs> hey, uh, Dave, we have a problem. Can we not attack? Oh, oh no. Hey, Dave, we have a problem. We have to get through these face downs. Oh. <laughs> you you need to attack with Inspector Border, and then in main phase two, you need to set evenly matched. Oh no! We are going to reach a problem if he activates Macrocosmos. Oh no! Oh fuck! Oh no! <laughs> set evenly matched, Dave. Set it. We have to get it in. <laughs> no, right don't set rivalry, you fool! Hey, hey Dave, have you? Do you know what evenly match does? Have you ever read that card? Oh no, Dave, you lose. 
Dave, you just lost yourself the game. Dave, you can't win anymore. Why? Nope. <clears throat> Reed evenly so, matched. Reed evenly matched. So, the only way we were winning this is by getting any life points ahead of our opponent. Because Dark Snake Syndrome is going to be dealing equal damage to us every turn. But because that's Marshmallow, we can't. And because you set Rivalry of Warlords, we can't evenly match him. You need to stop playing cards. Understand. You can't attack with Inspector Border anymore. Because of Nightmare Which is a problem. Well. Yeah. And also a problem is that this <laughs> rivalry is on our field. God, you're so doomed. We need we need to evenly Raigeki them. Yeah, you need to figure out a good deck that plays quickly just to get through the low ranks. Oh my god, you are so owned. Because you're going to run into random stuff like this that just doesn't care about anti-meta strategies. I'm, I'm annoyed that we're leaving, losing a Gravekeeper Servant because that's not a very good card. Yeah, but there's a lock that prevents you from attacking, period. <clears throat> yes, but like... No, he wobbatted you. That's what we're playing next week, Dave. That's what we're playing. Next <laughs> this copy is deck. Look at what he is playing. <laughs> play Mortal Wombat. Also, this man has not read. He is wondering why Stealth Bird no activate. He is looking at Stealth Bird like, why isn't this let me flip it face down? Oh? Uh. Oh? Uh. You're so fucking owned. Holy maybe, shit. Maybe you should have activated Rivalry uh, before he had a chance to go into that. Holy fuck, you're doomed. <clears throat> and by doomed, I mean not at all, because Power of the Guardians exists. Oh boy. This is a chat, this is how we get back. Because he just wasted this is, all that. This is how we come back. This is how we come back, chat. This is how we get back. You still can't attack because of the Nightmare Wheel, though, right? But we can draw a monster. Like Dimension Shifter. Eh. Dimension Shifter would be so huge here. Yeah. What, like, Normal Summon the Shifter? Normal Summon the Shifter. It cuts It cuts the Nightmare Wheel, wheel off, and it puts him down. He'll be below, he'll be below <clears> the life point. And we can play Golganda... Oh my god. Shifter is so good here. <laughs> normal Thank summon have Shifter in this deck. Normal summon Nibiru, normal summon Shifter. We got uh we got the tributes here. Alright, should uh, we use Golgonda? Yeah. We need to. Yeah. We need to protect Shifter. Unfortunately. The evenly matched uh is is kind of dead because we put up the rivalry, but now we can use rivalry as removal if needed. Oh my god, this is so huge because the Dark Snake Syndrome puts him under. Dark Snake Syndrome is a crazy card. Yeah, it's banned in like every progression series. I love how that it's. An ancient card too. What did this come out? You can just tell by the artwork. First set it's of the game. Spell ruler. Is it spell ruler? It's either spell ruler or I think all the burn cards came out in Metal Raiders. It might be Metal Raiders, but it... no, no, it's Labyrinth of Nightmare. That's the burn set. Labyrinth of Nightmare is the burn set. 
Mortal yeah, Wombat! Yeah, we just have to keep attacking. Probably if we attack monsters. one more time, we win, so long as he doesn't have Wombat. He needs a better card for... He needs uh, that old man card instead of that stupid WoW MST. Oh, dear. Target? Interesting. Is he targeting? I, I can actually target Necro Valley. Or save oh, Necro wow. Valley. <laughs> yeah. The <clears throat> nice Battle of Golgonda is just cool like that. It is just cool like that. Do any of those Elbaz fusions do anything in the grave? Uh, not in this deck. Okay. That'd be good in tunes. Fuck, they have a monster. <laughs> they have a built-in card that does that, though. Yeah, but he goes in more. Okay, so, what's our draw? Uh, goes in match. match. We have to set this shifter to defense mode. Really? We cannot allow that to be Marshmallow and us attack it. We cannot blindly walk into it without without defense. It's especially Marshmallow, because it, it's also obviously Marshmallow. It's Marshmallow. Uh, Stealth Bird is bad, but we can out Stealth Bird with battle, but we can't blindly attack. Hey, man. Because the Stark Snake Syndrome is going to kill them. You winning? Are you winning? We, ha we have Maybe. to deal 600 damage next turn. If we can deal 600 damage, we win. Not gonna happen. <clears throat> wow, that was a Right, Geki off the top. But. So the problem is, we're dead. We can kill <laughs> Stealth Bird. But, if it's not Stealth Bird, and we draw Rageki... Stealth Bird. It was Stealth Bird? Yeah, it was Stealth Bird. Unfortunate. Big unfortunate there. Goes in match and rivalry. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, setting that rivalry lost. Because we yep. could have evenly matched him. <clears throat> and he probably would have gotten rid of the Nightmare Wheel. What if we put a one of Fairy Meteor Crush in our deck? <laughs> I think we just need some background. <laughs> Yeah, evenly matched. I was gonna say a duster probably would be. All right, well this guy's clearly a blue eyes player, so. I would go get some. That requires a space kitty. It's a double IPA. How do you lose to these people? Well. Okay, so first of all, this is a weird one, but I think, wow, he's gonna shotgun the MST to Newman Normal Summon. Yep, That's you might actually win this one. Because if he's playing Max C, he's. Dave has become the paid actor. <laughs> <clears throat> Uh, well, yeah, actually, there's a super chat on the side there. If you want to pay Dave, he will continue to lose. That's true. I'll make an ass of myself for five bucks. I mean, you'll do it for less. Hey, five dollars is five dollars. Oh my god, it's that magical mallet. And we're not gonna judgment magic mallet. Is this Exodia? I should explain the shotgun maxi, just like literally, just I don't even care. Mm hmm. Oh my god, we have to stop that. Yep. 
And it's probably bait. It's probably bait. He didn't immediately normal summon something. I... I am... I like that. <laughs> Fossil Dino, oh yes. And goes in match? Okay. <laughs> might have got worse. <laughs> I mean, drawing two every turn certainly helps. Ooh, what are you going to pick? Back row, probably. <clears throat> All attack position monsters. What a mook. Okay. That's fine. Guess he wants to special summon monsters with less than 1800 attack. <laughs> now I can draw two bad cards per turn. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you know it. Ooh, that, there we go. Oh, with Moon Mirror Shield, that's perfect. Ladies and gentlemen, we got him. <laughs> the win con. <laughs> it was, uh, Ash Blossom. It was Ash Blossom. So, so does that continuous spell protect cards, like, plural? Uh, yep. So you're good from Lightning Storm. Duster. And one Duster. destruction act. And then I'm safe for battle. My board's immoral now. More or less. Well. Evenly matched would suck. That would suck. Oh, nice. Speaking of which. Yeah, I would love to do that right now. Right? He better scoop here. He if he doesn't scoop. scoop here, he's not a real person. Because that's huge. Wow. What are you, some kind of glutton for punishment or something? I can't even activate that. Nice. We got... We got Dino. I can see why you would use the statues. <clears throat> they just have, like, some kind of attack power. Mm-hmm. Because I think they're all a thousand? Yeah. So they, they turn into... So the they turn into... Uh, you have to have a monster that's... 1,500 or more attack? No, they they go up to fifteen hundred, and your opponent would have to play something with like two thousand, right? To get over it. Yeah. They could deck yourself out really quick. That card's kind of nuts. The draw two. Yeah. I saw it, seen it a lot in Runic. I get it. I'll have to play it in Runic. Can't play any hand traps, but all your spells are hand traps. Yeah. And sometimes you you like uh, right, don't have, you don't have and a field spell, form. so it would be nice to not just bleed advantage like nobody's business. Right. I've got popcorn now. Nice. 
Well, enjoy the show. Because I think this oh, is yeah, game. baby. He he wore it out. Like he he stuck it out. I'm I'm impressed. I like how Pyro got the uh, the correct characters in the chat. <laughs> I'm impressed. Look at that. We're cruising. Sure. That's what we're doing. Actually, not bad, all considering. You rank up pretty quick in the low levels, for sure. I mean, just my raw win, how many games I'm getting in, is actually pretty good, considering that this deck is slow as piss. Yeah, I wonder if it's any slower than, like, a full-on combo deck. Or if you have to wombo combo for... Yeah. Like, if, if you don't know what you're doing for a wombo combo, I could see those taking a little longer. Because people complain about the decks. Oh, I went and made coffee and came back. My opponent was still still going off. <laughs> Cruising through molasses on a cool January morning. All right. This is not an alpha, right? That's the other one? It is not an alpha. All right, so it just does battle damage. We are we're gonna slap a border down first, like a fucking ass hat. So they can't ash you. Is that why you did that, Dave? Yeah, actually. Okay. Or some whatever nonsense. <laughs> whatever nonsense. What do we want here? Ooh, that's big. I mean. Get the get the draw early. Yeah. Because shifter is dead now. Correct. Because I have yeah. one card in my grave. Yep. And we slap Clockwork Knight on the board. And we. I guess you could. I don't know. There's there's definitely. Arguments for leaving. Uh, I'm keep goes in my hand. Evenly matched in your hand. In case I get board wiped. Yeah. I mean, border. Uh, that's a big border. That's a big border. You should probably build a wall around that. <laughs> Made of clockwork. Yeah, he's a uh, non-inspector border. He's border inspector. <laughs> on his surfboard. Nobody gets past him. I've talked to this guy many times. He's a great guy. The best guy I've ever met, honestly. Other people say they're good guys. Not No, not even close. This guy, best guy. You can't do shit. Too coherent. Too coherent. <clears throat> I had to work on my vine, to be fair. Be like, listen, Jack. And then just like, oh, man. I, don't, I don't know what you're saying, man. <laughs> I love ice cream. It's great. Okay. <laughs> ice cream. I'm right here, Kenneth, with my popcorn. <laughs> hey, a fast win. The next move. I'm telling you, they're looking at Diabell Star in hand, wondering why no activate. Yeah, what, uh, what was your opponent playing? Check his deck. See if it was anything good. Oh, and all we gotta do. First of all, we gotta check this guy's deck. The uh Yeah, co <laughs> copy this. Copy this oh. before we lose this. <laughs> it's even it's even Pac-Man. Oh, oh it, yeah, baby. It's Pac-Man. But like weird. <laughs> it's weird Pac-Man. Pac-Man burn. Right, They're this, one of Dark Snake Syndrome by This the guy way. was playing oh, uh, Dark Magician Pile. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that's more fire was prison, at, right? That motherfucker was looking at souls in hand, wondering why it wasn't working. Yep. Part of our, the reason why we're cruising through this and already in silver is because we keep getting the coin flip. <laughs> that certainly helps. Like, we're killing it with this coin flip. 
That is a shit hand. <laughs> okay, it's not it's not terrible. Yeah, yeah I would still play everything. Alright, watch him shotgun Maxi and Shifter. No. <clears throat> uh, yeah, we're gonna Necro Valley here. I feel like with we're gonna Clockwork Necro Valley, Golgonda, Clockwork, Set Judgment. Yeah, yeah I think like, you play everything. Like this is okay. Like we're 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 duster proof. Mm -hmm. uh, we can stop a choice summon. Why Regeki in deck? It gets us through set one pass. <laughs> yeah, yeah, we keep getting stalled out by one defense monster. <laughs> That's why you play it. It's removal. You need removal and stun. We honestly to destroy monsters. We honestly yeah. could also use a. Um... No, you can't. Uh, Duster. What the fuck? Giant Self Kozaki. Self TK. Yeah, so you can just win. Just let him let him lose. Turn let that him. shit to off. Yeah, just turn turn off your chains and just let him let him go off. No, do not play Nobleman of Crossout. That shit sucks. Knock! I mean, this guy's got a gibberish name, so this is probably this probably is a bot. Like, this was named by like a spreadsheet. He's playing self TK. <laughs> Don't let him kill himself. Negate. I've done that. I'm not gonna let you go easy. What You're going a, out on my terms. Wouldn't a great smoke screen would be like you play like. Koza giant big Kozaki and your opponent's like oh, alright fine they turn this shit to off and then you hit him with like a stupid burn wombo combo like nurse burn or something <laughs> just to like you know catch him off guard you thought it was self decay oh so I was playing the new Final Fantasy 7 rebirth game yeah and one of the characters in it is a uh, proprietor of a theme park called the Gold Saucer. And his name is Dio. Mm. I love the Gold Saucer. It's so fun. And it is. It's a ton of fun. Uh, and then but one of the characters says Dio. Like when we're going back there to get something from him. Dio. The, char the character that says that is Matthew Mercer. Do you know who Matthew Mercer voiced? Didn't he voice Jotaro? And... Yes. Yeah. Dio. So Matthew Mercer said Dio in Final Fantasy. That's pretty funny. <laughs> and I don't know if that was a reference. Or a, just they got lucky. Is that a JoJo reference? Hey, look. Did Matthew Mercer do that? Oh, we, need to get, we need to get to the saucer in the desert to stop Dio. Dio. <laughs> Like, that's all he says. The whole line is just Dio. Like, come on. It's, it's a JoJo reference, right? I had to put the controller down because I was laughing so hard. Fatal Abacus. Destruction of Destiny. I mean, the high profile games for Matthew Mercer is a more recent thing. I guess we'll get this. What is he doing? Trying to D rank? He was the Nightmare King yes. in Tears of the Kingdom. Ooh. Grave Robber. <laughs> Necro Valley turned it off. <laughs> Necro Valley would stop specifically Grave Robber. It's on theme. It's on theme. I tried activating Sarcophagus Diddler. It didn't it, it resolve with no effect. <laughs> Why is that even a card? I guess Coffin Diddler would be a better that's got a that's got a better pentameter to the name. Sure, that we'll go with that. Coffin Diddler. <laughs> the stream is a fever dream. I mean First time? Yeah, right. <laughs> what is the stream not a fever dream? It's like the appeal to these. 
Oh my god, going first again! Unbeatable on the coin flip. I can't wait for this to be self TK. <laughs> yeah, I mean, I gotta get through that battle pass, right? I guess. Okay, we got we got some nonsense again. That's a lot of nonsense. Feels like too much Necro Valley. This guy's name okay. is P. Mm-hmm. But with threes. That's because the regular P is censored. Ah, uh, I understand. Like, no matter how many <clears throat> E's you put on it? Yeah. So, like, Rivalry and Tikaboo are like, you can play one card? Yeah. Activate Necro Valley. Can oh, I search right. uh, great end, end of the uh, season? Yeah, can I search uh, gold Gotha? No, probably right. I mean, you can in spring gans, but don't do that. Millennium Revelation. I'm sorry, what? <laughs> you can send one divine beast monster for your hand. Oh, to the graveyard, add one monster aborn from your deck to your hand. Flip both of those. <laughs> Flip th both of those right now. On res. I am pretty sure you just... I mean, monster reborn doesn't do anything. Flip your floodgates right the fuck now. It would also... I don't have to worry about clicking things anymore. That's, that's mostly it. What did he send? Phoenix mode? Yeah. 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 Is, can Phoenix mode be monster reborn? Yeah. Now with Necro Valley. That's a Kareda card right there. Mm-hmm. How come Coffin Diddler did <laughs> resolve with an effect? <laughs> Go, Coffin Diddler! <laughs> <Battle> has Coffin! <laughs> did you just... <laughs> that's, that's the noise it makes. <laughs> Uh, oh no! <laughs> <laughs> oh no! <laughs> nice. He's got uh, reflect metal reflex slime in defense mode. Uh huh. You guys ready? He's about to learn something rough about rivalry. <laughs> <laughs> That's you your one monster for the game now, buddy. Can't even attempt the summon, right? Nope. Nope. It's rough, buddy. <laughs> It does sound like Avenger Brothers. <laughs> <laughs> Coffin Deadline, he's such an asshole. Because I'm kind of doing what? the I'm kind of doing the a, monarch. He has a bird voice. defect. Yeah. He has an asshole for a face. <laughs> I'd love to be able to do a doctor girlfriend. Doctor girlfriend. Doctor girlfriend. Doctor girlfriend. Sounds like she smokes a pack a day. And also a, a, a dude. That's because you I can use totally to... negate that, you idiot. Yeah, did That's you know Metal Reflex part. Slime is a effect monster? You had the option to play in infinite impermanence. You could have negated as extravagant. No, I wasn't paying attention. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I'm sorry. He didn't draw anything anyway. Yeah, we need to draw a monster so we can start making counters. Right? He's got no extra deck cards. He had three he banished them all. just for so he could get one. He draw. didn't even play didn't even play six. <laughs> he didn't even play six. Ooh, Mound of the Bound Creator. Hey, I remember playing that card. Man, that's crazy. Anyway. 
<laughs> he could certainly set a card. Played that in Paradox, I think. My dragon deck back in the day. It was bad. <laughs> Clockwork. Okay, well, that'll come in handy later, I guess. The surprise tool we'll used for later. I need a monster. I need a frog. Yeah, Yada with uh, Moo Mirror Shield could be cute because it returns to the deck, top of the deck, so you can keep poking your opponent with it. Oh, that sounds awful. <laughs> that sounds awful. <laughs> Yada is only again. Yada is only good if you can get rid of all of your opponent's cards. We got a lot of board wipes in this game. I don't know. All right, we got a monster. It's just the wrong one. Chat, I'm gonna I'm gonna blow your minds, chat. Ninety percent of the cards on the ban list don't need to be there. Should I get? Should I just dump the shifter? And you? Yeah. Or should I hold it? Because it's a monster. You gotta know when to hold him. I don't think he could use it. No when to fold him. You know what? I'll use it. It's not gonna matter. It's not gonna do anything though. Cause like he with Necro Valley on board, I, I don't think it matters. All right. He could just choose not to do anything though. Card advance. <clears throat> Okay. I also played that in my dragon deck. Scry for five. It's terrible. Can't do shit. He can't initiate a tribute summon. He can, can tribute. He sat? Sat. Yeah, he's gonna use a sap. He certainly... He can tribute set a monster, but he can't tribute summon. Can you tribute set a god card? No. The so god they have, like a, they have a special summon. Summoned. They must yeah, they have a special summoning condition. Attack. Are they even a tribute summon? Because they say you must be normal summoned by tributing three monsters. Okay. They're okay. not a normal so, a tribute summon. So this is, this is a very annoying thing. Up until the printing of Soul Crossing, the god cards were not tribute summon. They were normal summons that required a, a tribute. <laughs> right. No, they were a normal summon that required a condition to be met. When Soul Crossing was printed, Konami in JP ruled it that they are now tribute summons. Because oh, because they are. They aren't. Not by the but word on the in card, the but... the OCG. Welcome to the TCG. Ask your goddamn judge. Mm-hmm. Oh, thank God we drew a monster. <laughs> uh. Oh. Fuck. So do you set that fossil dino and then pop his... No! Oh, okay. Activate power of the guardian. Start pumping this motherfucker up. <laughs> You got a palm. You up. <laughs> it forced him to send it to grave. Now, I gotta I might have to activate impermanence just to get it out of the field. I think you might have to. I, it playing Clockwork Knight feels kinda rough though right now. Why does he keep putting cards face down in like the one zone that you have a face down card? I don't know. He doesn't care. Yes. Because he's named P. Oh, uh, that makes sense. Uh-huh. That's very cool. It's very sweet, honey. You can activate your funny card. <laughs> he literally doesn't, can't work. <laughs> no. He doesn't have Jalgen. Secret Village sucks. All right, so do I, do I just, like, have to start... Taking damage? Oh my god, I could blow it up. <clears throat> Can you though? Mount of the Bound prevents targeting. Yeah. I got Rigeki. You can't clear a space. Or imperm. destroyed by card effects. You also can't imperm. You are correct. Because it can't be targeted. So I need to just sit here and take stupid damage. Just slam it. Yep. Come on and slam! It's only 800. 
not bad. It's not bad. Come on and slam! Welcome to the jam! Wait, do no, I have that Michael. Still? Raigeki would not be oh, negated. I got that. Do anything. Is this? Is yes, to go hey, hey. even further? It's in here somewhere. I'm gonna get rid of it. And this <laughs> is to go Wait, even Michael, further beyond the like, imperm column. Dave isn't that stupid. Well, why did he put that in attack mode? <laughs> Oh no! For the sweet release of death. <laughs> right? Is that what it is? <laughs> For the sweet release of death. <laughs> uh, I gotta get my uh, daily gems in. I can't scoop. <laughs> like finally, I'm unlocked. Yeah, an evenly match would be really rough. No, it wouldn't. He scooped anyway. Connection failed. Oh, okay. Oh, he didn't scoop. He just closed the app. <clears throat> He's sitting there taking a crap. He's like, you know what? I, I, I don't have time for this. I wasted a crap taking opportunity to get stunned yeah i like how the new season's gonna drop and you're gonna go right back down to rookie it's great wow we lost a coin flip oh no we'll go first anyway see oh <laughs> <laughs> uh, okay it's numerons i haven't seen uh, numerons in a while i'm gonna hit you with a brick can i stop them Numerons? With that hand, yeah. Uh, probably Shifter, right? Yeah. Yeah. Shifter stops them. They can't activate their field spell. Because that does send us cost. <laughs> and then we'll just set two judgments. There you go. You're good. How'd you know yeah, this as was long as they don't open as long as they don't open network guessing. the normal spell? And, uh. Joke's on you, yeah. guys. It's Blue Eyes White Blue Dragon. Blue Eyes White Dragon! Playing Mausoleum, Playing Mausoleum of White. Hey, they that gives you two normal summons. I'm gonna go brush my teeth. And spray. <laughs> wash my mouth out of this. Oh garbage. no, he discarded something and it didn't. Uh oh. You may have to judgment the polymerization. Right? What's he summoning with? He's gonna try to search a blue eyes white dragon by sending white stone of legend to the graveyard. Did you know that Dimension Shifter prevents that? Because <laughs> it banished it. <laughs> oh, oh, it banished his uh, his jet dragon. Yep. Now he's thinking and trying to figure out why that didn't work. Cool. This is a good place for a regeki. Right. Especially because I didn't draw monsters. Why card no work? So he's gonna search out a blue eyes, but he probably can't do anything with it. Not really. Got a polymerization and a blue eyes in hand. Plus one other card. Plus one other card. And Jet Dragon, at least one of them, is already banished, so. All right, uh, alternate. Uh, he's gonna. Mm. That's. F I don't know. The uh, 
Up to you. Because if he if that stays on the field, then he'll be able to poly. So either you have to stop the poly or you just stop the summon. If you do this, um, it wasn't properly summoned. Which means he can get it back with something? He can't get it back. He he, I mean, he'd have back. to, like, he'd have to get it back to his hand. Because it wasn't first summoned from the... All right, I'm back. Surely nothing bad has happened to you. So he has a poly and a blue eyes in hand. He's going to discard the blue eyes to try to summon something from grave. So I could stop this as well. You could stop that. Double judgment. On stupid stuff. Now you got a he. I mean, he wouldn't have been able to summon it from grave anyway. Oh, you're right. But it's okay. We're going to draw. You didn't take much more damage than if he had just attacked. Wow, we need a monster. Yeah, you do. And if he draws another dragon, you might be uh, so well. Drops Polly. We've lost Do a dragon. That there is game. That is game. <clears throat> You've been owned. By first of the dragons. That's obnoxious. Hey, you know what? It's okay. Sometimes you don't draw a monster. Actually, it's peak, I think. I think it's peak. I mean, how many monsters are you running? Not many. Yeah. I could probably stand at three more. Are there any of the ultra rare Albez that search out stuff that you could use? Not that it matters. I just need Jowgans as well. Yep. Man, I got a water flosser. That shit goes hard. Yeah, my dentist has been suggesting those. Really? They're so good. Mm hmm Yeah, Amanda's has also suggested it. I had heard mixed reviews about them. <laughs> mm. Whoever told you they were bad uh, probably hates things that are cool and feel good. Oh. Yeah, my dentist was like, just use it in the shower. Kyoto waterfront. Just lean over the sink. I mean, it's more of a just keep it in the shower and whenever you take a shower, flush your teeth. I do it uh, before I like wash up my beard in case anything gets hot. So it's not gross. So, okay, remove brainwashing. Very cool. That's the only downside I've seen so far. Mm. Uh, but yeah, it's great. Fantastic. Teeth have never felt fresher. So I imagine this guy is going to have a hard time when we summon a monster that doesn't allow him to special summon. <laughs> yes. Yes. Yes, he is. Because he can't do anything until I no. do something. Correct. And then when you do something, it's going to be like, you can't do anything. I'm not even, like, setting things to grave. <laughs> this guy's gonna be kind of mad. Yeah, he's bricked up, man. Like a... Probably has a bunch of, uh... Bunch of kaijus. Right? I do highly recommend it. It's Border. so nice. Hey, look! A monster! Border or... Hmm. 
I feel like Newman. It's gotta be Newman, because Border, he can kaiju. Border, he can kaiju. And then play the other clockwork? Just for more damage? Yes. Yeah. How much is a good one? Like 50 bucks? And like, if your job provides any sort of like FSA or HSA, you could probably use that. It's yeah. a medical expense. How oh, interesting. Yeah, just buy it at a pharmacy. Amazon works too. You can use your HSA account for Amazon purchases on medical items. Yep. He's playing like uh, legit guy. I got just like a wireless one. I'm going to get like a better one at Costco when I go. Mm. Yeah, it's like, it's so nice. Chat, clean your teeth. <laughs> it's true. He tried to kaiju you, Dave. He really did. It's like, why isn't it lit up yellow? I've also like just been using it like after I eat or something as well. Got one more win to go up to silver four or silver three. Very cool. Can you do it? Can you go first? Wow, we're going second. Hey, maybe that evenly matched that's glued to our hands will actually come in handy. Great, it's been dead every game. <laughs> it's like you need it because in theory you're going to go second half the time, right? And it's blue eyes. Of course it's blue eyes. It's always blue eyes. The double sage. Well, Blue Eyes is a structure deck, so. What does uh, that thing do? <laughs> I believe nothing. Uh, if it's special summoned, you can add a ritual spell or polymerization from your deck to the hand, and then during the end phase, you can add a level 8 or higher dragon monster. However, there is a very crucial stipulation at the end of that card. You must control a blue-eyes white dragon or have one in the graveyard for it to activate its effect. Interesting. Guess what he doesn't have? Either of those. I feel like it's Moon Mirror Shield. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. There you go. We did it. It's gotta flash the deck. So from rookie to silver three. silver three. It blew through it. Not bad. I just gotta win two more times for the next rank up. All right. You gonna go first or second? Did now you start losing the coin toss? Yep. Ooh, we're going first though. Mmm. Big hand, big money. Let's go. Come on, big money. Big money. That's big money. Hey, there you go. Not bad. Not bad at all. What do we get? Flash the deck. <laughs> the Dinah. Hey. Last card, too. Oh, I hate you. <laughs> oh, we're never going to be punished, are we? I mean, what kind of a stream would that be? 
Golconda. Necro Valley. Can you okay, just just can you please stop playing in in that zone? Which one? The the ones in line with the extra monster zone. Because oh my god, you are going to get like imperm into fucking uh Anima? Relinquished anima, relinquished anima, and you're gonna lose the duel, and you're, you're gonna, gonna be, be so anima. mad. You're gonna, you're be, gonna be so mad. Wow, no, a double summon. Oh boy, he's like, I don't care about your fossil tide. I got double summon. <laughs> Goki cage match. Oh, okay. <clears throat> Do I care about that at all? No. Double normal summon. He's gonna probably try to search rematch. All right, so we can get over with one monster. Yep. Well, and then he can tribute the other one to boost the other guy. So as long as he attacks the green one first. Isn't maintenance soon? That's on the 29th, dummy. Tomorrow, I think. Dummy, 29th. You can. You read. may want to impermanence that now. Yeah, you may want to uh, imperm the fuck out of that. Because then he can just quick effect boost the other guy and get over your Dino. <laughs> or don't. It's up to you. Yeah, you should imperm that. The curse of the stream being five seconds behind. There's also the cage match on field. Oh, it's too late. It is too late. Oh no. He's gonna resolve cage match. See what you mean. Yep. I swear to God. Your opponent is going to resolve Goki Cage match, I swear. <laughs> Probably. No, he doesn't have anything. No. Dude, please. The monster? No! Monster! <laughs> what a rip. <laughs> that was perfect. <laughs> maintenance is not tonight. No, maintenance is the 29th. I think it's tomorrow. Read! It's a 29. You have Master Duel! Maintenance okay. notice! Duration March 28th to the 29th. Hmm, tomorrow night at 11, our time. Hmm, PS4 said the 27th. I think you're lying! Unless maybe their maintenance is for different. I'm telling a Yu Gi Oh player to read. You're gonna be <laughs> fucking timed out for making a reading joke. <laughs> there, take take a fucking take a fucking minute. <laughs> Brutal. No reading jokes. That shit is so so dumb. Accurate. It's accurate though. It's not. It is. When was the last time you read the entire card? You look for like interactions with your opponent. That's it. I read the entire card every time I see a card. Up. When was the last time you won not in time? That was bait. All the time. See, I have this magical ability to uh, know what the cards do in the card game, Ryan. Yeah, you probably read them beforehand. Uh, you know what? I'm actually going to stop yeah, this. Yeah, I've uh, read the uh, card. <laughs> yeah. Because I don't know what he's going to be playing. No. Shouldn't matter? Shouldn't matter, but... No, it does matter. 
That's how he was getting to rematch. He put it in the fucking imperm column. Yeah, but he can't rematch. He's That's hilarious. Concerned. Yes, That's he awesome. can. He has Goki Guts and Goki Twist Cobra Engrave. Necro Valley! Yeah, he can rematch. It's not going to resolve. Okay, fair. And then he's going to attack into this with Moon Mirror Shield. Yep. Because he wants to destroy cards. So that he can resolve Cage Match. Oh, oh, uh, oh, oh. No, he's not going to do it. Oh, he read. reading. No, he was reading Golgotha. <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> he was reading Golgonda to see if Golgonda was once per turn. Which it is. True. However. Yeah, this guy is this is this guy is looking like me when he just wails like it's just like. Is he gonna activate the rematch? Oh, he's gonna try to. He's gonna activate rematch in the impermanent column. <laughs> That's gonna be doubly negated. But yeah, no, I uh, I do this magical thing when I play the card game, uh, where I read the cards, and because I you know play Yu-Gi-Oh. I know what the cards do because uh, reading the card explains the card. Do I put it in defense mode? Why? No, I don't. Because there's no reason not if reason Lumiere to. If gets blown up, I'm in a bad way anyway. Yeah, <clears throat> but you have a you have a little bit of protection from that. I do. He does have an endless conga line of gokies, though. Remember, <laughs> use protection. Remember, kids, always use protection. Kiff. <laughs> Unless you are ready for the consequence of your action. That doesn't sound like Zap Brannigan to me. That's because it's not. Did he just blow up his own guy? On yep. Purpose? Yeah. Probably. To get a search. How else was he getting to rematch? Yeah, he's gonna search. Hmm, the consequences of your actions just woke up? Hmm. Maybe you should have. Maybe you sh guys should have activated safe zone. <laughs> battle phase? Oh, then you, you do wouldn't not... have been destroyed by battle. Okay, I was like, you don't have a evenly match in here, do you? Not kinda... with a face up spell card, not he doesn't. Each match up. Ooh, judgment. <clears throat> match. I'll put the judgment down. That's a good just in case. We managed nice to eat... if we had a, a monster that could actually deal damage. Right. I think it's funny that we managed to eat two dark holes, though. Are you asking me what the third errata of Necro Valley is? Or are you asking me what the third version of Necro Valley is? Mm. One of them was the, it, it's explicitly added like you can't change the name of cards in the grave. That's some weird erratas, that's for sure. Because the third version would be the second errata. Hey, look, you can deal damage now. Which was it was it was uh, the second errata. The second errata, which was the third one, was where it said if a card would affect a card in the graveyard, it's negate that. It just said affect it, which is and why would, why it would, by that logic, negate cards that change the name or type or something of a card in the grave. Yep. Which is why they, I think, then decided to explicitly say that because that's a bit of a odd one to to call out. The A no. forces, okay. And then uh, they specified spell trap monster effect monster. Uh, effects that would do, do things in the graveyard and also they clarified the text uh, for the attack and defense of gravekeeper. I'm going to let it go. Because before I, it was I, just I like know the attack and defense is increased by 500 points if it includes gravekeepers in their card name. Because I guess that was the third errata. Technically could there's got there might be something in his extra deck he can play. Yeah, he's got lots of Gokis that require two Goki monsters. If he's trying to go into something like a Sold, though, he can't do that. Do any of the Gokis have less than 1,800 attack? Uh, yeah, I think so. Any of the Gokis have less oh, than Oh, the Lynx? No. He's got some. No, he can go the Lynx, yes, do. they do. One of them Goki does. Goki the Heal Ogre. Yeah. 
<clears throat> yeah, and that's what he played. The only one he can. It's on a gate. Uh, once per turn, when a monster this card points to activates its effect, you can negate the activation. Oh, I don't give a shit about this. Nope. I am not even going to judge with that. <laughs> <laughs> At this point, we're just going to mill him out. And he played in the impermanence column Nogali again. It was a soul drain. It wasn't exactly a soul drain. It was just like anything that happens in the graveyard doesn't happen, essentially. <laughs> anything that happens in the graveyard stays in the graveyard. Yeah, Feel like the coffin did later. <laughs> it was the first one. It was, uh... I don't know why they was, called me the so coffin funny. diggler! Uh, the, no. The original version of Necro Valley, if you guys <laughs> haven't read it, no. uh, says that the effects... Essentially, it says it longer, but the oh, effects no. of cards... Goki that... rematch is gonna summon two cards from the graveyard. What are you going to do? I think I'm gonna let it ride to see what happens. <laughs> but, uh... Did yeah, you forget so... that Necro Valley's on the field? The original text of Necro Valley said that if an effect involves the graveyard, it is negated. If it well, at least he can crash into your Newman and get rid of it, right? No. Anyway, you can for like three different reasons. <laughs> <laughs> what if we just turned everything into a gravekeeper monster? Then we get an extra five. He finally realized how little he could actually do. Yep. It hey, took Goki. him a long time. It's okay, Goki. I believe it. It took him a long time. I guess we kept stopping him, so he never fully understood the breadth of his scenario. He truly had one option. Heal Ogre. Yep. <laughs> this entire yep. time. It was Heal Ogre the entire time. Did we just max out our gems again? I spent a thousand earlier just to like get them out of. Time to pull for snake eyes. Come on. Hey, look at that. I Play actually, a meta deck. I actually got a good uh, good chunk out of the way today. Play a meta deck. Play meta. At least pull the fucking Diabell Star stuff. <laughs> there is so much in there that you can put in jank. Yes. The That's Bell the Star thing. Stuff. Like what? Like. The, the Diabell Diabell Star Star stuff. stuff. This thing? It searches any level one fire. That's like Jet Synchron. Or the Kui Jar uh, the what's that one? Kui Kara Divine Carnet. Yeah. This so like pack, you can right? any that's the one that tributes your opponent's monsters if they activate their effects. Yeah, Runic has a snake eye variant. There is snake eyes in this pack. This must be the pack. There is order. snake eyes in this pack. That is the pack. That is the snake eye pack. Ride you can tell because it has all the snake eyes. You can tell by the snake eyes. Uh, and in the other pack, it has the resonator stuff. The resonator package is super good in jank. I think you're gonna. You, you could totally use the Diabell Star stuff in something. Like Runic. Let's see if I pull it. Like. Over. Oh, I think you stuff. should just dump everything because it's at least a good deck that will get you free wins when you activate one card. Especially at lower levels. As soon as they see uh, Snake Eyes Ash, they're just going to scoop. Yeah, dude, I scoop to Snake Eye Ash activation. If you have Snash, I'm done. I'm, I'm out of this one. Bro. Even if it's the only card in your deck that's Snake Eyes, it's still scoop worthy. Uh, and instead, we've gotten uh, two of that stupid fucking wingman. Well, it's, uh, it's dust. I mean, like, I'm going to be mad if he gets more Diabell Star stuff than me, TBH. But... <clears throat> I mean, he needs dust material anyway, so, oh, like, attention. yeah, you need to be pulling from packs. This is just happens to be the best one, because either you're pulling from packs and dusting everything you pull, which is just bad card advantage, or you at least try to get a deck that functions sure. and the next pack has unchained in it and that deck rules uh, i haven't seen that one yet it's very cool it uses your opponent's uh, stuff as material yeah but the new stuff is way better <laughs> charvara is a custom card a lot of custom cards being released 
Yeah, they've been doing that now. Did you see the Trickstar support? <laughs> I saw that it existed, but I didn't read it. It's great. I just looked for your reaction to things to see how good they are. Yeah, uh... Chat, what you gotta know about the upcoming cards? Uh, Rika is Cope. Uh, Tenpai rocks. Uh, Tenpai looks support. interesting, for sure. Yeah, it's an OTK deck that's, like, meta. It's an OTK deck that just, like, says, this is my battle phase now. Yeah, in the OCG, Snake Eye players have started making Assembled Nightingale to stop getting uh, OTK'd. Nice. And you, do you know what the Tenpai players responded with? Okay, buddy, we're gonna make Armory Arm! Alrighty. Wow. I mean, that's a lot of Ultra Rares. Jesus. Keep going. I got another copy of this. Keep going. Good fucking thing. That's dust. Keep going. You got Flamberge. You got Flamberge. All right, we got we got Snash. Or Poplar. 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 That's a good one. Good. You also have uh, the Central Soils uh, spell card. Field spell. It's good. Yep. The field spell's good. Because, like, you could play... The Ash is a super rare. So that's easy enough to craft. Having one Poplar is fine. There's right, there your Ashes. Look, and your ash. second Flamberge. You're you're just... You're getting the deck. Just yeah, a small you need engine. Yeah, star Well, yeah. Okay. But I got TG close. More dust. That's your play set of Ash. Yep. Ooh. God, right. so many gay packs. Okay, well, I got too what? many. Wow, two more Flamberge? <laughs> oh, those are dust. So you remember Block Dragon, right, Dave? Yeah. That's, that's what Flamberge is. That's what every Snake Eyes monster is. Keep going. Okay, Let's be real, Ryan. That's what every Snake Eyes monster. That's true. Original sinful spoils. Original sin. Solid. Solid. I mean, you're pretty close to minimal engine at this point. Yeah, you just need the Diabell stars. I got three of them. No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Holy cow! Wow. I'm so <laughs> mad. I'm so <laughs> Livid. <laughs> I am. Let's go. Livid. Let's go. I don't even want to play this. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> I'm. Oh my. Ah. Uh. <laughs> Amazing. Oh. Well, good news is, Dave, we got some cards to work with. We can actually build you some decks. Okay. Oh my god, I'm gonna fucking. Oh my <laughs> god. Go <laughs> hit a casino. casino. <laughs> I'm I'm so mad. Oh, we'll, that's we'll, amazing. We'll rip our last thousand. Let's see what we get. There All you right, go. We can dust this asshole. So. Uh, oh. So that means you could probably just craft one wanted with all the dust that you get. Probably. Yeah. <laughs> Fuck you. Because we got all those stupid wingmans. Yes. You have plenty of material to craft at least one wanted. Uh, so basically, when Dia Bellstar is summoned, she searches out cards. Original simple or, spoil. Or sets, sets them, simple spoils sets them to the field. Um, and then you activate simple spoils. And so. And it summons a level one. She summons herself by sending a card from your field. Or hand. Um, or hand to the graveyard. So it's very easy to special summon, very easy to get the effect off. Um, it searches out. Basically the entire engine. So, um, I think so, I think I'm you so have mad. pretty much the entire engine, at least a mini engine, to slap in whatever you want. Oh, okay. so I'm we so got mad. we got cards to work with. We can we can theory craft something. Because if you have the that aspect of the of the thing with like a meta deck being shoved into a rogue deck, is you have things that you can interact with your opponent now. Yeah. So it's not like, oh, the my one strategy got stopped. <clears throat> so you have ways of recovering, you have ways of of baiting out the single ash. Oh. You're not gonna die to a single ash blossom. 
I'm gonna scream. That was that was incredible. Ryan, please please look in the mod chat for uh, my suffering. <laughs> oh no, that's rough, buddy. Chat, that's rough, I am buddy. currently twenty seven thousand gems into this pack. Dave's like eight thousand and pulled three D Bell Star. Five. It was on five thousand. Right. Last was on 5, uh, last Wiggly card. Uh, was uh, wanted, by the way. Also, that simple <laughs> spoils on the far left there, and you got a wanted. Nice. Uh, hey, Dave. So that far left card is just a free put any monster your opponent controls in their spell and trap card zone. It it pushes it into the back row. That is it targets, but it is non destruction, non graveyard removal. Um. So I am 27,000 gems into this pack. I have one Diabell Star, no Sinful Spoil, no Wanted. That's but I have us. gotten 31 TG Rocket Salamander. Well, you could hey, craft Rocket a couple Salamanders cards. Rocket Salamanders is great. All right, Dave. That is... I want to build. That's, a, that's a good deck you got there. Right, so... Dave. Oh, I'm so mad. If I want to look at the cards I just got... Uh, you could probably do recently acquired. Yeah. Either sort by recently acquired or do like sinful or snake eyes. Okay. That works too. So your ratios are gonna be <clears throat> uh, three witch, three hot woman. You probably want two or three of the uh, two of the original, and then three of the wanted. But for a mini engine, you're probably fine with one of each. Okay. So add one of each of the first five cards in that deck, and then three of Diabell Star Witch. If you're if you're doing the minimum engine, it is uh, one Diabell, three wanted, uh, one uh, sinful spoil, one Sil Silvard. Okay. But if you're playing like an actual Snake Eye deck, uh, that shit is three, three, three. Yeah. All right. So for my Snake Eyes, what do I run? Uh, three Ash, two Flamberge. So the big big Snake is two of. Technically, Little Snake is three of, but play max number that you have. Poplar. Um, one of the field spell, one and of the then field spell, with one of the quick play, one of each one, of the other names. Yep. So one of temple, then one the one to the right. Yep. And then one of that guy, birch, and then you need oak, which is you might have to. No, I think you pulled it. So then add one oak. It's a green card and a normal. <clears throat> it's at the bottom. You saw it. I saw it. Scroll down. Yeah, right there. Right next to that fusion. Right. And one subversion. It's the one that looks like a giant eye. The one that pushes cards back into the field spell. It's so a... Yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yep. So... so that's your engine. That's the whole deck. I mean, you could you could probably drop the poplars down. To one, because no. if you don't want to craft them, but you just pulled a lot of ultra rares that you could you could definitely. Uh, but yeah, dust. so uh, that's that's basically the maximum amount of main deck investment for this deck. Okay. The rest of the entire deck is not engine, and any one name gets you to the entire deck. Okay, cool. The extra deck is where we get funky. We can, uh, for Snake Eyes specifically, you can do like Link or Synchro. Uh, Kashtira Snake Eye is the most popular variant. Runic Snake Eye is a deck. I probably should uh, start with Runic Snake Eye just to sure. ease you into the list. effects. We'll, uh, we'll build that soon. But yeah. I mean, with what you just pulled, that is that is you worth do whatever playing. You want. You can do whatever you want for the next, like, year of Yu-Gi-Oh! Pretty much. Because you... you know what is 
a tier zero in all formats right now, Dave. This deck. Like you could even you could even run Rescue Ace with this. You do because original sinful spoils gets you to hydrant. If you had any interest in that deck whatsoever. Because hmm. that has one one of the cards in there just says, hey, you have four cards in your deck. Just why don't you set those to your spell and trap zone for free? Turbulent says set four spell or trap cards to the field. And one's a fiendish chain. Or one's a one's an infinite impermanence, one's a regeki break. One's a monster reborn, and one adds back from the graveyard. And, and one's if you control a control hydrant, those turn into more things. Yeah. So right. like there's a lot of interaction. I think you might actually like Rescue Ace, actually. Well, unironically, because it cards. No, but like the way the deck is right now, it's pretty low rarity and it interacts with your opponent. Like your opponent activates a card or special summon something, you can do something from your hand. And it interacts with your opponent a lot. So like you might actually like the deck, and then the Diabel Star original simple spoils really adds to the consistency a lot. Gotcha. Alright, well we'll so, come up with something for me to build and we'll build it before the Because that might history. actually not be might not be dumb. Because also, you just need to know how the deck functions, so yes. that you know how to beat it. Oh, so next turn, next week is tournament. Yeah. So I probably should stick with the runic snake eyes build. Yeah, we can ruin your tournament with it. Excellent. I mean, will you go into time every time? I don't know. Yes. Okay, great. <laughs> uh, but for, for unrelated win. reasons. Mutant for the win. <laughs> every time. <laughs> All right, guys. Yeah. I think that's when we're going to call it because I got to get to bed. Fantastic. Fantastic pulls. Really. I mean, I would say it was a good stream, but. Fuck you, Dave. I mean, my win rotation was great. My pulls were excellent. I think. I, uh, yeah, I you kind of won win. the stream, unfortunately, <laughs> somehow. <laughs> I uh, call it an I'm... absolute win. I call this an absolute win. <laughs> <laughs> Three Diabelle Star. Oh, brutal. Fantastic. Anyway.